Needing to cook a complicated meal at the end, the end of the day, well, that can be pretty chaotic. So how about something quick, simple, and full of flavor? I like that. Mm -hmm. Showing us how to do that is Cassandra Brown. She is the owner of Una Bella Salute in Berlin. Thank you for joining Welcome. us this afternoon. How Happy are you? New Year. Happy, Happy New, New Year. Year to you, too. <laughs> so what are we making today? Today we're going to do a pasta stir fry. Okay. Uh, it's t we're using um, tomato um, pasta, mm -hmm. tomato flavored pasta with cracked pepper Ooh. and sauteed vegetables. Okay. 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 So of course you, we're going to start off with mm -hmm. some of your uh, olive oil. Olive oil. Yes, we're going to use the basil olive oil because basil mm -hmm. and tomato go really well That's together. That's my favorite. Absolutely. By the so way. So we're going to drizzle some of the oil into the not much not <laughs> <laughs> of the oil into the pan mm -hmm. and kind of just get that heated up so we can put the vegetables mm -hmm. in. Yeah. There we go. Yeah. And you have olive oils that complement just about every dish, don't you? Yes, mm. we do. We do. Now, um, what we're going to do, if you want to I can help, help you out. Mm -hmm. We're going to toss in some of the veggies here. We mm. have a cucumber. Oh. Mm -hmm. I think it's hot. Yeah. It's hot. <laughs> and we have um, green, red and green peppers. Red and green peppers. Oh, can I stir? Sure. I, I always stand on this side and never do anything, but yeah. I think I'm going to do some broccoli. And we have some broccoli. Now, we did saute the broccoli a little bit before we put it in. Mm -hmm. Now, if you don't like your broccoli really done, then you don't have to. Okay. And we also have some colorful um, cherry tomatoes. Oh, mm. those look good. And we're going to put those on it at the end. Okay. Oh, okay. And I have to say, I don't know that I've ever seen cucumber in a stir fry. I know. It's That's more of a uh, Indian. Um, our Thai dish. Oh, okay. They use a lot of cucumbers. Uh, Do cucumbers. they really? Yes. See, mm -hmm. I need to eat more Thai food. Yes. You know, it's very colorful. Right. Very and, colorful. And cucumbers are very good for you. They're very nutritious. They they are a natural diuretic, mm -hmm. and they uh, have a lot of vitamins and antioxidants. Fight fighting. Um, um, Properties. Good for, good yes. for the heart. Yes. Yeah. Uh -huh. We're uh -huh. always looking for and that. And so are uh, red and green peppers. Red and green peppers are really good for inflammation. And uh, so everything in here is pretty much healthy. Mm -hmm. Of course, you know the broccoli is vitamin, mm -hmm. I think it's vitamin A. And uh, so you got a lot of healthy vitamins. So we're going to stir fry that for okay. just a tad bit longer. Mm -hmm. All right. So okay. where do you get these recipes? Do you just come up with them, or do you this find one, them? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we have recipes on our website, mm -hmm. and uh, our um, some of the other um, stores, our distributors, like myself, mm -hmm. I may go on their website and snatch one of their recipes. Mm -hmm. I do have some customers that have come in and made something, and they post it on my website, mm. or they'll call me and tell me, I did such and such with the oils and vinegars, mm -hmm. and they um, share their recipes. It really does take a dish to the next level, mm -hmm. the oils and vinegars mm -hmm. with the infused flavors, doesn't right, it? Right, right, yeah. okay. So we can just toss in those onions real quick. The onions really quick? Uh, not yeah. all of them. Not, not all, all of them. Okay. Yeah, just now are we, oh, is this high enough, do you think, or it stops sizzling a little bit? I turned it down a little. Okay. Do you think I should? Just a, just a, yeah. We're, we're, we're just a, sn just a smidge. smidge. <laughs> yeah. Just a smidge. Yeah. All right. And okay. just the onions. So we want there. the, we want the vegetables to keep their color, so we don't want them cooked too much. So now you can go ahead and toss in the pasta. Okay. All that of it. Some yes. Interesting pasta. Yes. And we have a lot of pastas at our store that are infused uh, when they make them. All of our pastas are handmade, so they don't go through that processing of store, you know, but mm -hmm. they make them in small batches. Should when I, I be call stirring them. this? Yes. Or? Mm -hmm. okay. I'm trying to blend it in. <laughs> and uh, when I um, call them and say I need pasta, they, they usually, they're making it constantly, but in small batches. Okay. Um, okay. We are starting to bring in a gluten-free line of flat pastas, mm -hmm. and um, when I called, he was telling me they're just coming out of production. They let them air dry as opposed to putting them through a machine or anything. So, so that helps as well. That's the way that they did it in Italy, or they st probably still do. Mm -hmm. I did not realize that they actually hang it on the clothesline. Really? <laughs> in Italy, they hang it on the clothesline for it to dry. That's awesome. And uh, so they do the same thing with the air-controlled room. Um, that, where they dry their pastas. Interesting. All right, well, we're gonna let this kind of cook up a little bit okay. and uh, take a little break, and when we come back, finish it up and taste it. Stick okay. around, don't Marvel Life, we'll be right back. Yes. 
We've been continuing to stir up our pasta stir fry during the break with delicious basil infused olive oil from Una Bella Salut in Berlin. That's all thanks to Cassandra Brown. She is the owner. So what else do we have left to do with this recipe? Okay, we're going to uh, sprinkle with the spoon. We're going to mm -hmm. put a couple spoons of the um, Charmaine um, seasoning, okay. which again is a, a blend that Charmaine has done on her own. Um, she started doing her own seasonings because she was running into health problems. Okay. So she started making her own blends. So these are all gluten-free, no MSG, and um, no um, antibiotic, I mean not antibiotics, um, they're, they're all natural. All natural, okay. yeah. <laughs> yeah. All natural products, okay? Yeah. So, and we do have a variety and that came from the can that we have and she's put together uh, several different uh, oh. pastas in here, I mean not pasta, seasonings. Seasonings, yeah. And they uh, are amazing, all of them, you know, really good. Um, if I may plug my aunt, who is 104, oh. she loves the um, everyday seasoning everyday. because she has gotten a sensitivity to um, seasoning, certain seasoning, ah. but that works really well with her. They're low in salt. All the salt that they use is um, sea salt. Okay. So, okay, so we've got this done. Okay. And what we're going to do is, if you will, sir, mm -hmm. yes, we're going to pour that onto that plate. I can help you out there. <laughs> and I was, and while he was doing that, I was telling Cassandra that I, um, I had to feed a lot of people, not Christmas Eve, the night before Christmas Eve, I made a big salad, and instead of trying to figure out what salad dressings everyone wanted, mm -hmm. I just put all of my uh, infused olive oils and balsamic vinegars on the table, and mm -hmm. everyone was like, "Oh, let me try. I want this one." <laughs> right, right, right. I yes. my mom. Um, <laughs> <laughs> it yes. worked out really well. Oh, yeah. Let's just turn it off. There okay. We go. So what we're going to do now, and just so I can, uh, um, put this out here, mm -hmm. this is all veggies. But right. if you wanted to throw some shrimp or some grilled chicken Ooh, or, yeah. or, right or, or some steak or something oh, in here, yeah. you can actually certainly do that, mm -hmm. okay? You're talking Mike's language you right You really there. are. Okay. We're already starting to drool. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so what we're going to do is put the rest of the uh, um, scallions on. Yep. And you can use regular, you can use purple onions or regular onions if you want it. We just use because we were going with the color thing. Mm -hmm. It's almost Christmassy. It is. Uh, and then we're going to grate the uh, Parmigiana cheese all okay. over. Just tell me when. <laughs> I never say when. <laughs> just, I never say when either. <laughs> it's not grating. It's, you have to push, push down on it. Oh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You put a little muscle in there. Sorry. Right. There you there go. You go. I, I haven't worked at Olive Garden in a while. I was ready to say. <laughs> I'm ready for my next job. Yeah, yeah. Okay, there you go. That looks, that looks yummy. Okay. And, uh, so and there, you go. there you go. There you have it. Awesome. That's interesting. Okay, I'm going to switch places oh, okay. with sure, you because I don't want to sure. try to get a noodle uh, over okay. top of you. It would definitely land on. Now, this is an interesting noodle to try to eat. Yes, this, they're called Papadella noodles, and it's the style of the. the, the, mm. the <laughs> mm, so good. That flavor hits you the moment you get the fork mm -hmm. next to your lips. Mm -hmm. that, that is delicious, that basil, Sandra. Mm -hmm. This Charmaine's little seasoning, that's fantastic. Mm -hmm. And you can find all of this in Unabella Salute. Yes, you can. And you're located in Berlin. At 6 South, Ber 6 South Main Street in Berlin, mm -hmm. yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right across from the um, Greyhound and Madison Avenue. We're right. on the opposite side of the street, right beside Dreamweaver. Can't miss us. Awesome. Can't miss it. Yeah. And then if you do go there, you will let folks sample the, the, yes, the oils. Yes, you can actually come in and you can taste the oils and the vinegars at will. Um, you don't know what they're like until you try them. Sure. Mm -hmm. And we've had people to come in and they don't want to try them, then I, uh, especially the vinegar. Mm -hmm. And some of them are like, oh, I can't drink oil unless I have bread. No, you can. <laughs> and actually, <laughs> taking a shot of the olive oil, especially the un unfused uh, natural olive oils, are good for you every day. Yeah. Okay. It helps it helps your circulation, information, brain health. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of benefits and to you. We using. could all use those yes. benefits. Yes. <laughs> Sandra, thank you so thank much. You. Thank you. Again, happy new year. And happy new year. It's gonna to be us. a great year. Yeah.